Whoa, 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 whoa. What is up, guys? <clears throat> How are we doing? Doing all right? Uh, let's get into it, boys. I don't got a lot of time. So I want to... Uh, I want to... Um, get into the... Uh, get into the, the stuff here. You know what I mean? Get into it. I'm real quiet to you. Song is pretty dope. You're, I'm real quiet. Okay, let me turn up my gain a little bit there. How about now? Is that a little better? Are we peaking a little bit better now? What it do? What is it and what it do? Guys, I'm taking deck requests, by the way. Um, if you want to see me play a deck, uh, if you want to see me play a deck, let me know what deck you want to see played uh if you want me to build a deck maybe there's something we can work out um maybe there's a little you know a little, a little spicy something we can work out there you know what i'm saying uh you know what i'm saying you're gonna see me build a custom deck i'm gonna be giving out stuff for new subs i'm gonna be giving out codes um thank you man i love my painted black deck too um i've got some pre-release codes to give out um, Slindo, I mean, what are you looking for, man? I mean, I might do an Explorer or two. You know what I'm saying? I might do an Explorer or two. I don't know. Who know? We, we don't know. There's no way to. There's no way of knowing. Um, play some Mill. So, guys, um, Mill. I could do Mill. I have a Mill deck. It's not very good, but uh, I certainly could do it. Um, <clears throat> right now I'm trying, just trying to get my dailies out. Uh, ooh, take my horse to the old growth troll. I'm gonna take my horse to the old growth troll. YouTube always says it's not getting enough info to be smooth. I, I don't know why this is. It's constantly telling me this. I, I turn the coder down. I turn everything down. Um, so I'm sorry if it's choppy. I'm using OBS. I set my OBS settings exactly the same as my other OBS settings. Um, so I, it's unclear as to why uh, YouTube specifically... Um, has this problem uh, it's not not 100 percent clear as to why they want to always say oh it's it's i don't know we're not getting enough information it's literally the same if you watch me on twitch it's not choppy uh but if you watch me on this for some reason it comes out choppy so i don't i don't know is the answer to your question there um let's uh let's just bully through people man let's just absolutely bully through people um, Grixis Vamps. Grixis Vamps uh, is not as good as any other Vamps. In my opinion, Grixizing Vamps adds nothing to vampires. And the thing is, everyone's like, well, Evelyn's good. You don't have to play Grixis to play Evelyn. She has a flexible cost. So I, I have tried to make Grixis Vamps a thing so many times. Um and it just won't work for me. I, I just, I don't see the value in it. I, I have a hard time seeing the value in it. Warzone Vampire's not bad. It, it, it's not. Grixis Magecraft. But what is the value of adding blue? 
what what is the value of a triple color what could we do with that triple color that we couldn't do in in double color that's my question genuine question what could we do in triple color that we couldn't do in double color Xander, that's the question. Is Xander worth the effort? That's the question we got to ask ourselves. And of course, we don't hit the, the last land drop that we need, so we're doomed here. Good game. Ugh, I, I don't feel like Xander's worth it, man. The, the best thing Xander's going to be is a freaking lightning rod to get m removed immediately. Corpse Appraiser. I don't see Corpse Appraiser as that good of a card. Sorry, I don't see Corpse Appraiser as that good of a card. I don't think it's worth it. That's what people tell me. That's the one thing. They go, oh, well, Corpse Appraiser. I, uh, you know. It lets you, it lets you draw a card lets you draw you you can get another you can get another thing in your hand like oh, okay okay i can look at the top couple of cards in my deck like all right um exactly t spokes t stokes hit it on the head there xander's, xander's only good in reanimate or otherwise he's too inconsistent trying to hard, hard trying to hard cast him You've got to be able to put him back out. You've got to be able to run protection from him. He's such a high value target, dude. It's just. Yeah, but if I'm running Orzob, I can actually wipe all the board and not have to worry about it being killed. Um... Hey, Carl Abdul. Um, what's up? It's a couple of guys catching me live for the first time. Guys, we are running all kind of fun stuff today. If you want to see a deck. Um, built. Right now they're trying to make me run. I'll run a Grixis Vampire to show you it's not good, man. Um, I'll, I'll run it and I'll show you the difference. I mean, if, if we're there. Um, but uh, if you want to see a deck, if you want to see me play a previous deck, let me know. Um, don't forget you can actually like this video despite it actually being a live stream. You can actually like it. I know it doesn't make sense to like a live stream, but that's certainly something that happens. Um, if you want to make requests, um, if you want to see me build a complete deck, then maybe we can do a dono. If you want to throw a donation out there, donations and subs are enabled for the stream. Um, I also have a link for... Um, wow, that's a fucking terrible grab. Jesus. Um, I have... a. Uh, the, the link right there for my uh, Factor 79, 75 meal box kit. Anybody who signs up for Factor, you will get a pre-release code for six um, New Capenna packs. Uh, or I'll send you a J Villain hat. Either one. Whichever one you want. Um, if you want to become a channel member, I'll give you, I'll give you a code for six free packs. That's fine too. We can do it that way. Um, oh, he's bringing, doing the return upon the tide for swirling mist. All right, well, uh, ward three. All right, let's do this. You want to attack brutal? Ward, activate, bang. Um, yeah, you ran Xanyu in your Kami, Kami ear deck. Yeah, he's eh. He certainly is eh. actually did me a favor there that fight rigging was fucking crapped out on what it grabbed um absolutely crapped out on what it grabbed there Svoba dead how you doing Svoba dead um Demogoth Titan so let's do fight rigging I'm trying to, I just built this. I'm trying to make it work, but I don't know how. It's worked a couple of times well, but when the removal and counter and bounce, I mean, um, 
yeah, I mean, in this control meta, dude, it's just, it doesn't work. Um, it doesn't work. It's very, very hard. Shadow Knight, hey, what's up, man? Ah, we, see, we missed you for a while there, Shadow Knight. Seiju who endures. Okay, so let's do this one. He's gonna be running basically. He's gonna be running Grixis control. People are strange when you're a stranger. Something and something. It's something, something. Return upon the tide. Yeah, he's just running Grixis reanimator. He's just running Grixis Reanimator. And I have drawn nothing but my kill cards here. I've drawn no kill cards here. It's fun to soft lock people. All right, man. Where's the ban button? Let's see here. Carrying storm. Uh, report message. Yes. Hateful comment. Okay. Report to YouTube. Suspend account. Okay. All right. We got that taken care of. Yes, we are running some, uh, we are running some, whatchamacallit here, we are running some YouTube live stream. I can see you, Jake Hale, what's up? Oh, it's, oh, it's Grim. I see your logo is, is, uh, whatchamacallit. That Titan, I did the Titan Obnix listening, man. Um, I did the Titan Obnix listening, and, uh, um, it worked. I did a really good job with it. People didn't really watch the video, though. They were so fucking tired of Nixless. Um, yeah, I should be on tonight. I mean, I don't imagine why not. Um, good game. That's the problem, guy. You, you have your bell rung? You have your bell rung, or you just fucking just... Oh, YouTube will show me the, the, the videos that come out. I'll just rely on YouTube. They've never made a bad mistake in their whole life. Yeah, a lot of people. I go, they, you you don't you don't realize how many comments I get that go, Jay, when are you gonna do a fucking uh, when are you gonna do a mono black uh, uh, discard? I'm be like, bro, that was one of the first decks I did. It was like two weeks ago I did one. They're like, what? I'm like, yeah, in the new set I did that like the third time, and they're like, oh, oh no. I'm like, yeah, man, you got you gotta watch, bro. You gotta watch out for the. You gotta hit that bell. You gotta hit that bell, bell, bell. Because I will put out videos and it's like YouTube buries them. I don't know what it is. It's not even that they're demonetized. Um, uh, so what's the next step? So what's the next arena set as Adventures in Forgotten Realms? Um, no, it's not Adventures in Forgotten Realms. It's going to be... All right, what's the request, guys? What do we want? Uh, no, no, carrying storm. I'm not. I'm not getting on you, dude. I'm. I'm just saying it's funny that uh, I get that sometimes. I get that from longtime viewers too, man. Um, but yeah, it's on there. If you look up any kind of riveteers, it's going to be on there. As a matter of fact, we might have it built here. Um, what do we want to see, guys? I'm. I'm waiting on you. Nobody gave me a suggestion. I said I'll play. I, I get a thousand comments. What do we, What do you want to see Jay play? Oh, I want to see you play this. All of a sudden, it's we're, we're live. You're sitting here with me in front of you. It's like, what do you want? And then everyone just mum. Everyone's just just silent. What's up with that? That's what I want to know. 
technically, technically, the next set is going to be the um, Yakami War deck. All right, go ahead and report. Uh, report user. All right. Ban. There we go. Goblin9 said wolves. That's the first freaking uh, good suggestion I've heard all day. Um, doesn't take much to give me rules. Any Black Death deck. All right. So why don't we try Black Feather? Well, let's try Black Feathers. Let's see if that works. I don't really like Super Friends. Um, so I've been playing this game since 1994. <clears throat> so basically to me, the uh, Planeswalker is a new mechanic. Um, it's a brand new mechanic. It's 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 brand new. I, I it's it's like it's. I don't really like. I I I'm not nuts about Planeswalkers. I have done some Super Friends, but eh, it's Stokes to add to to um. Uh, to answer your question, Battle for Baldur's Gate is technically the next set coming out on Arena. It's going to be a. A re it's going to be an alchemy only set and I think it's going to be for alchemy and historic um, no I don't think it's going to be historic I think it's going to be alchemy only um, and we are going to do some content because alchemy is not as bad as people think um, so uh, Loth is good uh, Loth is perfectly fine um, we like Loth it, it should be, but I haven't seen any piece of paper that's told me that 100%. So I'm hesitant to say 100%. Yeah, it should be. I, I, I just don't know if it is guarantee um, that. Let's do Blood Vile Purveyor. People are strange when you're a stranger. Spider, 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 spider. It's going to play removal. Gonna play another one of those. Gonna get seven. Boom, boom, boom. There's your kill right there. Listen, man. T Stokes. I gotta put you on the spot, bro. I'm gonna make a whole video about this. Because that's the number one thing that I hear about alchemy. I just put out two alchemy decks. Two top tier alchemy decks, by the way. A mono white angels and a mono black zombies. Oh, and uh, no, I put out a mono black zombies too. And I put out a Demir Rogues that's alchemy. The only cards they use, the only ones that you need to add are uncommon alchemy cards. And they're top tier. They'll run in diamond. I could probably run them to mythic. The only thing they use is four, four to six uncommon cards. If I tried to make a competitive explorer deck, competitive explorer deck or a competitive historic deck, I'd be looking at probably, I don't even, I don't even want to imagine how many I'd have to do. If we go on Aether Hub and look, we can go on Aether Hub right, look right now. I'm going to show you because that's the biggest complaint and it's a false narrative that I think people are pushing. Um, you can look right now on Historic Best of One. Um, you look on Historic Best of One right here. Azorius Angels or something like that. Or Azorius Auras. Um, with Lures of the Dream Den. All right. All this crap you have to get, right? I'm going to show you what I have. MTG Arena format. We're going to copy it to the clipboard, right? We're going to bring it over to Arena. We're going to go to Dex. Um, and we're going to import it. Even me, who have been playing since uh, probably for three years now, even I would have to craft for this. Okay? Even I would have to craft right now for this. Look how much I would have to craft. Apply styles. Craft all. Three commons four uncommons and 17 rares for me for me 
that would be almost the entire every single rare that I have. This is currently the number one deck, the top rated deck in historic. Um, we can look in Explorer too. Uh, discard changes. Um, and I picked a bad historic deck for my point. Most of those cards are common on common. That's still seventeen cards to get a competitive um, historic deck. Let's look under. Let's look under Explorer. Um, let's look under Explorer here. Deck of uh, historic best of one. This is just Aether Hub. Um, let's do. Uh, Where's Explorer? Do we have an Explorer? Traditional Explorer best of one. Boom, right here. A little bit more popular, I think. Rakdos Unsealing, Hamhawks, Aggro Landfall. Boros Aggro, what do we got here? Um, these are not too... The Great Purge of Life Gain. Let's try this one, Great Purge of Life Gain. Um, uh, if we look here, 41 cards. Let's see, it's waiting. It's taking a sweet time to pop up here. MTG Original Jax wants this. Okay, Resplendent Angel, blah, 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 Heliod, Fight as One. I actually probably have most of these, but even just looking, even if you just wanted to get this one, man. Now, I'm going to tell you just what you need from the non-thing. Voice of the Blessed, that's four. Speaker of the Heavens, that's four. Um... And Heliod, if you're not, if you don't have these historic cards, I do because I played them. If you play them, that's four rares. Okay, Healer's Hawk, Lunark Veteran, all these the rest of these are decent. Um, this would be a top tier Explorer Angels deck. I have most of these because I used to play Historic Angels. Uh, even so, just to make this with stuff that is not available in Standard, let's say let's say you have the Cigar to Splendor, but getting the um, so that's eight rares. Let's actually just tells you right there. Eight mythic rares and ten rares if you don't have them. This is uh, on Aether Hub. Um, now, if we go to this. Now, let's do this. I'm going to show you right here. Alchemy. Alchemy best of one. Let's see who the top guy in Alchemy best of one is. Let's see what the most popular deck. Oh, look. It's Mega Death Zombies. It's Mega Death Zombies Black. There are only four four cards in here that are alchemy and they're uncommon that is all it takes to upgrade this deck from a standard deck to a alchemy deck the only ones that i added were sanguine brushstroke oh this one this one is a rare one yeah so it's four rares these you can run common or uncommon you get them both everything else is available in standard if you want one that's even cheaper we'll look at some of my other ones um, that's four comments. Contract Killers, okay? Let's take a look at Contract Killers here. This, I made this one too. Four uncommons. That's it. That's all it needs to do to change it from standard to alchemy. Boom. The other, what was the other one? Eight mythic rares and 12, and 12 rares. Uh, let's look down the line a little bit. Let's look at another one that I built here. Um, MTG Assistant really crapping out the decks here. Uh, let's go to my, uh, Aether Hub site there. Ba, 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 ba. Um, we look at anything with an A is going to be Villains, Angels, Mono, White. I think that's going to be Alchemy too. Yep. The only ones that I added for this Angels um, are going to be the only rares the, uh, are going to be Celestial Vault. I added three of those. That's four uncommons. And I added... Uh, where's that weird thing that they added? That's, uh, Skyline Savior. Seven uncommons to do this Mono White Angels. So if you compare the historic Mono White Angels to an Alchemy Mono White Angels, um, the, the cost is just, the, the cost is just vastly different. And I don't know why people pushed so hard that it, it was outrageously expensive. I, I really, it, it confuses me as to why people kind of push that narrative of, oh, it's so expensive to run alchemy. Yeah, if you're trying to max out every single, if you're trying to, if you're a completionist, yeah, it's going to be expensive. I'm not a completionist. I don't really care if I have a full set or not. I still have a bunch of sets that I don't have full because there's cards that I know I'm just never going to play. Um, but uh, yeah, there were a lot of historic players Um there were a lot of historic players that made it their business to take tor torpedo alchemy when it first came out. 
that was literally their goal. They hated it. They they hated. They were mad that you, they were viable in alchemy, and that was Wizards' mistake. Um, that was Wizards' mistake doing that. They shouldn't have done that. And if people there was such backlash, they should have retracted it. I know companies hate to retract things, um, but um, um, there was people that literally every day. They put out a new video about why alchemy was horrible and you shouldn't play it and it was so expensive. It was such a ripoff. Um, but they they literally that was their that was basically the entire content on their channel. That was their that was their channel. Was just shit shit on alchemy. Period. That was the goal. Um So You know, and and I think it got a bad rap. I really did. I really did. Arena, oddly enough, Arena is the cheapest way to play Magic, so. They, 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 they do hate on it for, for what it is. Um, and here's the thing where I fall, you know, a lot of older players don't like it. I feel like I'm the oldest player that likes it. Um, I, I feel like, uh, I feel like a lot of the older players, oh, it's ruining it, it's digital only, bro. My, my, as, as, as the meme goes, my brother in Christ, this is a video game. Oh, but it's digital only. Yeah, this is a digital game, dude. The, we're playing this on a computer. You see, like, you're looking at a screen. You see my mouse moving around. This is a computer. Of course it's a digital game. Why wouldn't you have a digital only format? Every other competitive... Um, every other competitive card game out there has a digital only format. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's, uh... What overlay do I use? I used Aetherhub. I use, um... I use the um, MTG Assistant by Aetherhub. That's why I go with Aetherhub there. Um, that's when I use. Uh, so, I mean, to, to just deny... To, and I, a lot of people... Um, uh, a lot of people don't like that experience. And I, I get it. Um, I get it. Like, if you're just trying to have a pure tabletop experience... It's a, uh, it's a whole thing. Oh, he's gonna do the double. He's gonna do the. He's gonna do the infinite combo bounce here. Good game. No, no, no. There's th listen, man. If there's people who don't like it, there's one thing. If you don't like, personally, I don't really like historic. Um, I don't really like Historic or Explorer. I don't like Best of Three. Um, uh, I don't really like Best of Three. Um, modern and Vintage, yeah. A lot of Arena players don't know what Modern and Vintage, yeah. Uh, if you go to freaking Modern or Vintage or, or what is that classic where it's like every card, um, it's, uh, it's a bad time. Um, I don't like Bless of Three. I don't like drafting. And that's there, there's no problem with not liking a format and not wanting to play it for that reason. Um, but the the main argument, like, you know, the, the main argument that I hear is that it's a cash grab. And it's like, cash grab? Have you guys not heard of, uh, have you not heard of Secret Lair? Secret Lair is a cash grab. The, the literal reason Secret Lair exists, it has no mechanical purpose other than being fancy cards. That's that's its that's its sole purpose is being a fancy cards for to spend money on. It's a literal way of getting more money out of you. Um, it's a cosmetic only, expensive premium product, and that's it. That's that. It's the very definition of of cashing in on. Uh, Magic's back history for whales to spend money. So if you want to, you know, you want like a, a special foil thing or something like that, you just, uh, you just do it. You grab it. Um, that's its function. This is not ranked, so, well, it doesn't really matter, I guess. I mean, the difference being a cash grab and being 
first of all, it's a game. So, I mean, yeah, they're, they're trying to run a business and they're doing a game. Um, you know, I don't, as far as compared to other games, I don't feel like it's so predatory compared to other games. Um, it, it, it's, it's hard to say a hundred percent. Um, Yeah, that's certainly expensive to be competitive in. A at the very least, if I go out and I buy a big booster pack for money, I'm gonna get a functional game out of it. You know what I mean? There's there's gonna be a there's gonna be an actual game of cards attached to what I purchase. If I go out and buy a booster box, an entire booster box, or you know, of of whatever how many packs that is, I can make a deck for that with those things. Like it serves an actual physical function. Um, what I would consider a cash grab is something that doesn't actually serve any function. You know, having all premium f shiny foil lands does nothing but, you know, make you feel cool. Um, and I, hey, man, listen, man, people want to feel cool. There's nothing wrong with feeling cool. I like feeling cool, but I personally wouldn't spend that much money on it. Um, Wesley Donison, Simic. So the price of me running a Simic deck is going to be a Mercedes SLK black with black interior. Um, uh, in case you didn't know that yet, that's all you got to do. Just make, just, just get one of those and, um, we will, we will be ready to go. I'll have the Simic deck up and I'll probably get it tomorrow. Uh, you show me the receipt that you bought. It's on the way. Um, and we got you, man. Absolutely. Mercedes SLK hard top convertible. I should be specific here. Uh, that's what I need. That's what we're going to need. Uh, Junji, a midnight sky. Discard two cards. Blood Chief's Thirst. Meow, 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 meow. Eat Junji. There we go. Um, believe it or not, I've actually run Simic decks before, but it's become so much of a meme on my channel now. I'm just leaning into it. Um, by the way, guys, you can actually like this deck. Um, I want to take some deck requests. Um, oh, he's going to hook me. Is he not realize that body launderer is just going to come back from the dead with the same crap again? He did not realize that. Um, listen, if you want to be, if you want to get a different hardtop convertible, uh, you know, I'm, I'm fine with that too. I'll take care of the gas, man. I'll take care of the gas. I know gas is expensive right now, but I'll take care of the gas. I, I'm not that bad. Um, what do you guys want to see, man? You want to see? You want to build a deck? What do you want to do? Um, I'm 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 here for you. I don't have a lot of time. Oh yeah, it is zero power. I forgot about that. Well, we'll just have to do it the old-fashioned way, won't we? Yeah, I have a, I have so, I have a GTO. I have a GTO, um, nineteen sixty nine GTO. You want to see an Explorer? I got a mono red Explorer. What kind of Explorer do you want to take a look at? Boros Magecraft with Illuminator and Bloodthirsty. What's bloodthirsty? A frog deck? I mean, a frog deck would technically work, I suppose. What's he going to hit? He's going to get a power word kill there. Boof. There you go. Uh, it's Simic Colors. All right, well, just uh, go ahead and... Uh, uh, 
There is. There, you can actually make a um, you can actually make a soul tide frog deck. It actually works pretty well. I actually made one. Uh, ninja frogs. Um, it it works. Uh, I shouldn't say it works well. I should say it works okay. Um, Shamble boy. It's probably got another removal. Uh, let's get rid of Soren. Ah, uh, bloodthirsty adversary. Okay. So you want to see an aggro? I mean, I did a Boros Illuminator deck already. I feel like I'm treading same territory. Uh, um, eh, we'll take a look at it. We'll take a look at it, guys. Um, that's going to be six. Yeah, LC has to do is not that's five I miss him by one so we do that there we go can't go full on on him right there both probably has a meat hook or something that he'll hit me with blood chief's thirst I twitch we gotta learn there and then that's going to give us... Oh, these are all these are all sorceries, so they're not instants. That's why I don't like... Uh, whatchamacallit. So he's got two menacers. He can go in. However, we can do that block right there. It won't matter because he'll put me at zero exactly. Slug decks. Eh, I'm so tired of Toxrill. But let's take a look. Let's take a look. What did we want to do? We want to do Toad or do we want to do Boros? We want to do Frogs or Boros? What are we feeling? Super Chat is enabled, by the way, guys, in case you want to get your message across. Um, or you want to suggest something or just flat out buy the next deck that I play. Uh, I'll perfectly allow that. Frogs? Are we feeling Frogs? A standard frog? Uh, yeah, let's take a look here. Hmm. Tatsunari. Hmm. Enchantments. Tatsunari hits good enchantments. Frog Hemoth is pretty beefy. Um... Okay. Uh, omnivore. Mm -hmm. I don't think there's enough. Might not be enough frogs. What if we did alchemy frogs? That adds a little bit more. Adds a git rod. Hey, thank you, Luigi. This is a freaking novel, man. I don't think Get Rug's that good. 
seek a land card. Uh, add opponent may sacrifice a non-token creature. If they do, tap get Rog Hor of Zava, then seek a land card and put it on the battlefield tapped. Um... So you can basically sacrifice non-token creatures to make it, and I get lands. Eh. Mono green counters. I actually have a mono green counters ready to go, Gregory Lewis. Um, which is familiar. That's alchemy. And what does it look like in historic? Uh, what if we did historic? Probably looks even crazier. Yeah, there's a lot more frogs there. Mark Louisier, what's up? Gregory Lewis, Luigi, uh, um, Doug Dickman. Doug Dickman, oh yeah. That is, you can't tell me that that's your real name, bro. That's your porn name. Doug Dickman. Come on. Nobody's believing that, dude. Okay. Yeah, my name's Rock Longwood, too. Come on, Doug Dickman. Doug Dickman coming here trying to tell us that's his legal name. Doug Dickman. Dun, 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 dun. Tatsunari. I actually really like Tatsunari. Um, I actually kind of want to do something with Tatsunari. Hmm. Your friendly Drift Ronin. Hey, it's Drift Ronin. Gregory Lewis, how you doing? Guys, you can like the video, by the way. I also want to direct you to the link at the top that I've pinned at the top of the stream there. Um, I am very happy to have a sponsor, um, which is Factor 75 by HelloFresh. Um, and, uh, yeah, you can get a... Uh, you can get a... Whatchamacallit here. You can get a HelloFresh. You can get meal... Um, meal box is signed up for you uh if you just want to get four a week it's pretty cheap and you get 120 dollars off uh using my code so you know that's not bad try it keto calorie smart chef's choice and vegan and veggie it is more of a healthy hello fresh option in case you're on a diet and want to lose some weight um which i think is not a bad thing so, what if we did a gain and drain with Tatsunari? I'm a bit curious. I might want three Tatsunaris. Let's do Frog Humith. I'm, I'm calculating here, guys. I'm thinking. We might have to do other things than frogs. Um, uh, so, if we did, if we leaned in on the enchantments. We did it, leaned in on cheap enchantments. What if we just did amphibians all together or lizards or something like that? Let's do that. Enchantments. Huh. Cemetery tampering. Azusa's. Visitor, whenever it casts an enchantment. Alright. So we did that. Commune with spirits. Uh, so you did a Golgari enchantment type thing here. Hmm. We did an enchantment creatures. Okay, enchantment creatures. Uh, the only place we have enchantment creatures is going to be Kamigawa, so. Um, Tatsunari. Okay. Enchantment creature, so let's see. We do creature. Let's find all of them, guys. We have Dockside Chef for that one. Hmm. Weaver Harmony. I think we're going to want that one. Bamboo Grove Archer. I don't know if we're going to want that one. Um. Hmm. 
Huh. Gloom Shrieker. Graveyard to your hand. There's a Tanuki. I don't know if we want Greater Tanuki. Raid Reckoner. Let's put Dackside Chef there. Shrine Counters. Bear of Memory. Toshiro. I think we want Okiva Raid Reckoner. I think we want Okiva Raid Reckoner. Tatsunari, and let's do Dina. Um, yeah, I think Keto is just not a lot of carbs. I think it's mostly just... Uh, I think it's just mostly that. Dina, okay. So we're gonna do a gain and drain with enchantments. I'm gonna try to trigger off enchantments. And life on oh, do, 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 do. Life of Toshi Bro. What if we gain life? Raid. And what if we also wanted turtles? I don't really have any that good of turtles options for us, so let's go back to enchantments. Sorry this is if this is boring watching me brew, but I'm trying to kind of figure out a combo here. Hmm. Snake Ninja. Generous visitor. Oh, Capitec Wrecker, I don't want that. I do want to me transients. Sacrifice a creature. We did a vengeful strangler. A little vengeful strangler, and let's go for a. We probably don't need that many. Um, Kodama. It's a legendary spirit. What about trample? We need a trample on here. in legend uh, let's turn off creatures we just want legendary lands one two one two Takanuma we can do that one and then we, of course we can do comes one, one and then of course we can do unless uh, all right we get these down to Twenty-four lands is too much. So, what are we leaning towards? We're leaning towards green. Let's do that. Twenty-three. Boo, 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 boo. Dina Soul Steeper gain life. So we can gain life. For 
specimens. I misplay so much, am I going to be able to do combos? I'm sure I will. I'll figure out how to play this game eventually, guys. I know I'd, I I'm another 24 years I'll be I'll be right as rain. So you don't don't you don't you dumb don't don't count me out just yet, man. I'll figure it out one day. Um Tamio safekeeping. Let's put two of those in. Why not? After rotation, mana bases are going to be a little trickier. We're going to lose the pathways, which was probably in my opinion the best mana base that you could get for the money at the time um let's do let's do unranked first because I, I have no clue if this is going to work a little bit all right guys here's going to be your frog deck here is going to be your honest to goodness frog deck Okay. It's snakes and frogs, basically. Snakes and frogs here. I'll keep a raid. Each opponent loses. We'll do this. All right. Hive mine. Hit it with the removal, perhaps. Shambling gas. No. Okay. Weaver harmony. Poison the cup on Weaver. Very nice. Sacrifice creature. I don't know. Let's do that one. Very nice. All right, we need another black. Let's put down two Vengeful Stranglers. There he goes. blank discard do that interesting choice deck request zyme there you are zyme um zyme right at the top there there is the factor link um in case you wanted the factor link there it is for 120 dollars off your next factor 72 order um Deck requests, yes. We are doing deck requests. All right. Fortell, I don't think that that's gonna cut it, my guy. He might have an instant here, but uh Got an instant poison. Still not, still not in a good position here. I 
Henrika Domnika Domnathy. Transform her. That that's not gonna do anything, dude. I'm gonna I'm gonna menace through. Oops. Oh. I almost fucked that up. <laughs> I hit attack all. He he scooped before I could fuck it up too bad. Um, well, he was still pretty much fucked at that point. I mean, you know it wouldn't be a J if I, if I didn't fucking horribly misplay something. Uh, that's the goal. You know, my goal is to, is to misplay as much as possible. I like to stumble into Mythic. Um, all I need to do, I like to just absolutely bungle my way into Mythic. And people are like, how did you fucking even do that? It's, it's, you're terrible. Um, it just kind of goes to show that it's mostly luck and time. You know what I'm saying? Plus, I don't really like to try very hard at things, you know what I mean? Effort, when you think about it, guys, effort is overrated. Effort really is overrated. Uh, putting an effort in things is just... You want to do as little as possible. That's the goal. Ah, there we go. Opponent goes first. Not bad on our enchantment frog scorpion deck. Oh, I actually like that as a first play there. I don't think I added one single thing from uh, Capenna on here. That's what's funny. Yeah, this is all old stuff. There's nothing from Capenna that boosted this deck. Oh, okay. We have that. Oh, he's not going to like this. Slindo. Necroduality. Okay, that's not bad, but I think he might be. He might almost be. No, he's out of gas, dude. Don't attack with that. You're already out of gas, dude. This dude, this dude's already dead. I don't even think he realizes he's already dead on his feet. I am gonna be getting real into Baldur's Gate, man. I like any new content. Anything you can give me that's gonna be new content, I'm gonna do it. Easy. GG easy. Well, I guess nobody wanted pre-release pack codes or free hat. Uh, I thought I'd be able to give away a bunch of stuff today, but uh, guess not. SMH. I'll give a free pack code to new channel members. You want to hit a channel member? But boo doo doo doo. That's a little better. Keep. I think I might only go with three frog hemis and make a little room early. Uh. Yeah, we're definitely going to do Baldur's Gate um, uh, 
We're definitely gonna do Baldur's Gate stuff. Like I said, I'm I'm a fan of content, man. If if it's content, I'm gonna look at it. Unless it's Simic, then I'm not. Let's put down Kami and Transients. Who's he gonna blast me with? First time live, does that count? First time live, you get your first streamer shout out, Marc Lucier. Marc Lucier. Marc Lucier. Marco Lucier. Sorry, I Italianed up your name. I don't know if that was the right thing to do, but I did it. Baldur's Gate will be in Arena. Yes, it absolutely will be in Arena. Yeah, if you sign up to, uh, you sign up to, um, uh, what the hell was I going to say? You sign up for Factor, um, you get a free hat. What is this guy doing? Is he just gonna board wipe me or? Probably burn down the house, I would imagine. Don't nope, rip apart. Yes, I will be using the hat pick, don't worry. I will be using the hat picture. Don't worry about that. It's gonna happen. Uh, let's do Kamiya Transients. Sacrifice Kamiya Transients. Hit him with the old seven piece, boop, boop, boop. And there we go. There we go, guys. That's a, was that a triple? That's a triple, man. Um, that's a triple play right there, guys. For the old, uh, for the old, the new deck. 100% win rate, frogs. All right, you guys, you got to see it here, live in person. I got my daily deals. I got this creative outburst. 100% um, win rate, frog decks. You were there. You can go and say, I was there for the 100% win rate frog deck. Um, I watched him build it, and I watched him execute 100% win rate frog decks. Frogs frogs is a new meta, okay? That's what you can go out and you can tell people, bro, frogs is the new meta right now, man. You got to look at amphibians. You got to look out uh, frogs. You got to look at all that stuff, man. Yeah, I got to go too, guys. It'll give you a little bit of a bonus here. Make sure to like the video if you want to become a channel member or make a donation. Of course, you will get those six free pre-release codes, those pack codes. 
Um, if you want to sign up for Factor, it's delicious meals delivered to your home. They are my affiliate. I'm affiliated with them. They give me a, they, uh, they are the sponsor. Um, if you want to check that out. If not, the link is right there. If not, don't worry about it. Um, hey, Psycho, how you doing, man? Uh, I will be on tonight. Green Black Death Touch deck. Um, we will absolutely do one, Aaron Cummins. If you're not subscribed, make sure that you're subscribed. Um, if you don't have the bell on, make sure the bell is on, guys. So many people are missing uh, decks at games because they don't hit the bell. Um, and that's all I got for you today, guys. I got to get out of here. I got to go start working on uh, some stuff, some other stuff. But I am so glad that you came. I am happy you're here. Aaron Cummins, how you doing? Green Black Death Touch deck. Probably going to do some Death Touch in the future. I'd like to see some more Death Touch support coming out. But that will probably be uh, coming down the road. But you can always catch me on Twitch too. Twitch.tv slash ThatVillainJ. It's always the links in the description. If you want to drop a line, go by uh, my Discord, AetherHub, all those places. Um, any place that you want to go there. Carl Abdul, how you doing, man? Thank you so much for coming, guys. Um, I've been Jay Villain, and you've been great, everybody. Thank you so much for coming. And I'll check you out next time. Bye-bye.